So, this is the final goodbye. Everything's being cleaned out here at Fairway Bowling or Native Massachusetts. Really crappy day out, but yeah, at least it stopped raining. For a at least bit. it stopped raining. So, you know, you know what I noticed in there? What? Looked like looks like there was a hole in the building a little bit hmm. over one of the lanes because there was a little light shining. Well, you can tell that like parts of it up here, like if you can see, like it seems like a little bit's crumbling and stuff. Like pieces are falling off from the roof and stuff like that here. But oh, yeah, right there. Yep, exactly. But um. So yeah, that was our final time bowling at Fairway Lanes and Natick. So I, it's really a shame it has to go. So many good memories here, especially with the Channel Five shows. And um, so we had a good time though, right, Eric? Yeah, we so, did. So it was good. So I just hope that, um, well, really can't replace a good center like this. Though Sammy White was just as good, and that closed down back in 1986. So it's been 25 years since. Uh, since the Channel 5 bowling center is closed, if you think about it. Yeah. And let's just hope Pilgrim Lanes isn't the next victim because that's the last one that has Channel 5 blood in it with um, the championship shows. So that's Fairway Lanes in Natick, and nothing can replace this bowling center. Really great center in Natick, and um, I just hope that they could build new centers in the future, but centers seem to be going out left and right, so this is truly the death of a great member in the Candleton Bowling mem in the Candleton Bowling family, if you could say so. Yeah. So. Absolutely. Yep. So that was the final video at Fairway Lanes here in Natick, and I will see you guys. I will see you guys all later.